first look delicious amazing airbnb old town rama anticlimax we had hey guys today i'm in a town called Rauma. It's like 90 kilometers away from Turku and it's actually like one of the oldest town in Finland that has a lot of wooden houses and narrow alleys. We are going to stay here overnight to just check into our Airbnb place and now I'm just going around to have a first look of how Rauma looks like. This whole town is listed in the UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1991 so it's been almost 30 years the bus stop is just right there if you're taking like Onibus or other Matkahualdo bus service that's where the bus is gonna drop you off and then you will reach the right next to the church which i think it's pretty impressive church from the first look around the town looks really really cute with all these wooden houses narrow streets and the cobblestones and you will see that there are trees coming out from different fences and usually they are full of apples pears and they just look so delicious and smells aromatic in case if you're wondering i'm riding this bicycle which is provided by our amazing airbnb place owner so there are two bikes available at the airbnb place and i brought one Right now I'm in like the market square area of Old Town Rama. It feels like a lot of the shops are closed and by the way right now it's like 5 p.m. on a Saturday evening. Sooner or later we're gonna go find a place to have our dinner because we had like a very light snack for lunch. So I'm now gonna go back to my Airbnb place and I'm going to meet Leo and we're gonna go find a place to eat for dinner. right next to the city hall which you can see the tower right there it's pretty impressive i found a city bike for rauma it looks quite different from the ones we have in helsinki it's like 50 cents for 30 minutes if you are a student from the design of the bike i think it looks really really stylish So I check on the website called Visit Rauma about the things that I could do in the Rauma city and it turns out there is a field full of sunflower and you can take a look at them, you can pick them up for your own usage. We are now on the way to go find that sunflower field. There seems to be a train track. Okay guys, luckily we found a field which is just right next to the main road and you can see it has some onions growing 
in the ground there are also flowers growing and over there you can see some flowers to see a big field full of sunflowers but it just turns out to have like two three stalks of sunflower so after the anticlimax we had we kept riding towards the other side the flowers are not blooming anymore but at least it is a field full of sunflowers This obviously is another day. Yesterday we had dinner in a restaurant in Old Rauma and then we had a little bike around in the city and then came back straight to sleep because we were really really tired. Right now we are gonna go check out from our cozy little Airbnb place. The plan is to have breakfast at one of the oldest cafes here in Old Rama and then we're gonna go check around in the town and gonna go back to Helsinki. It's almost 12.30 in the afternoon. 
I guess because it's Sunday today, there really isn't that much shops open in this town. Even though we wanted to check out all the boutiques or the shops, we couldn't because a lot of the shops are closed. Well, I guess we have seen pretty much everything in this town. Indeed, the place is very beautiful. The design of these houses are very pretty that I don't normally see day-to-day -day basics. So I'm pretty happy that I made a trip to this town called Rauma. Yeah, I guess um, we're now about to go back to Helsinki. It's gonna take three hours of driving. But thank you guys so much for watching and I'm gonna see you guys in my next video. Bye! Le grand amour de ma vie m'a pris par la main simplement Dans le jardin des Tuileries où nous jouions tous deux enfants Et les doigts de sa main jolie je les tiens encore contre moi Car le grand amour de ma vie C'est toi Jamais tu ne fus plus belle Et jamais plus aimée Pourtant ce soir à me rappeler